Okay, everybody. How's it going, Dr. Incompetent here? Let's play some Satisfactory. Alright. Well, I have a lot of work to do, and I really appreciate all of your encouraging comments that you guys have been leaving with tips and just, you know, the overall positive response to the uh, zaniness of my project, but also just the joy that you guys all express uh, with the game and it just inspires me to play more and enjoy more and see what there is to offer I love that you're not spoiling it for me I love exploring everything and just seeing it for the first time and being blown away with what's there uh, however efficiency tips quality of life tips strategy tips uh, those are all very very useful to me as I get my head around this game so I'm starting to see now for example that I've got lots and lots of holes in my production line. Eventually, I will build my own assemblers uh, that are, you know, taking built materials, but uh, I realize that I just need to up the scale of everything I'm doing. I've got a bottleneck now with rods. It's very interesting for me to explore the game and to see how uh, I need iron the bottlenecks emerge, you know, as my technology advances and, and on and on. Uh, let's see, are there any iron? There's there's the ones that are right by me. There's one very far away, and then there's uh, these three that I have over here. But that's really it. So I don't have, you know, and I'm playing on, like, the most bountiful world. So where I'm at, I don't have... The, the complete luxury of just so much iron that it's uh, crazy. But I guess if, if the resource nodes are truly infinite, I could just place a bunch of portable miners as like a stopgap to help me out for a bit, you know? There's nothing wrong with that. Just kind of, even if, if they're at the base, I could deal with the tedium of like unloading them and, and all of that stuff. That's... That's probably something I could do, but I'm going to go ahead and, speaking of portal miners, um, let me see my inventory. I do have one on me. Do I have enough to build a miner if I find it? I do. I have everything I need. So let's go see if we can find some more iron. It looks like there's one, you know, way over this way. There's two yonder. And so we can go get those maybe right past our concrete plant. But it makes me think, you know what would be beneficial too, is a quality of life experiment for myself, which would be a, a launch pad. I don't know how many leaves do I have on me. I have a ton, actually. So I could easily then make uh, some bio fuel stacks that don't get processed, right? Because I have this toggled off, don't I? Um... No, no, now it's turned off. Okay, so what's what's here? There's biomass. All right, great. And I'm going to just go ahead and uh, directly drop leaves onto this. How many can I fit? Fall 500? Perfect. And this is going to start helping me make biomass so I can craft uh, the jumping. So a jump pad itself is easy to build. Uh, but to not die would require... Uh, the soft pad. Now, what I can do, I guess, is just practice building a jump pad down below here, off of this ledge, and get myself back up. It, it won't be good, necessarily, for the trip down, but it will at least get me into the habit of seeing, like, how big, how far does this jump me, and, and how much distance can I cover? Uh, because I can, I can fall, like, right here and not suffer... So, let me build a jump pad, right? Oh, and there's a blue trajectory line that will indeed show me, like, how long this is going to go. Oh, it requires power. Son of a gun. Okay, well, then I have power lines over here. All right, so, for example... Let me just see if I can get one that will jump me up high enough... Uh, boy, it's... I wonder if I can get it to go any higher. 
that looks like the peak of it. I mean, I could build one here and then build another one up on that ridge. This is a little bit maybe too high. Fascinating. I could... Well, all right, fine. Let's build it then, like, right there and see what happens. Okay. Oh, this this broke my grid. Well, I have to say I didn't expect that to happen, but that's my own fault. Um, I can't toggle the, the power from here, can I? I wish I could. Oh, yeah, you can. Wow, how cool is that? I didn't realize I could toggle the grid. All right, so this goes back and... When working, yeah, there's there's only there's not enough room on this. All right, so well, let me dismantle this and just realize that okay, that's going to be a wrench in the proverbial gears for my jump operation, which is that uh, it takes power and it takes a lot of power, and so things like that that I have built to you know get all the power out here for this operation which is basically just uh extract concrete and or you know limestone and turn it into concrete that's all this is and that takes all the power from that fascinating uh what is this nothing new okay uh let me see where these iron is up here oh there's a bunch of it actually oh there's it says there's some up here is that right Let's explore. I don't know. Let's have some fun. Here we go. Here we go. What is this? This is pure iron. Beautiful. And this is pure iron as well. Awesome. All right. This guy wants to tussle. I don't really want to. I understand you're, you're upset. Now. Ooh, there's some, there's some uh, resources over here as well. Okay, so this is a good start. A bunch of iron here, great. Okay, so the miner is what, number eight? That's a smelter, uh, what's six? A biomass burner, oh, another one, okay. Well, the only good thing about this is that uh, I'll, maybe I'll have enough carapaces for my ma'am. Uh, do I have a miner on here? I'm not sure, anyway. I'm going to build one here, and we need to send it to our base. Fantastic. We will immediately need a smelter. And we will need a constructor. I'm doing this one at a time. <laughs> Look at the legs on that. That's sweet. Now let's make sure that this can connect. Too steep? Okay. Yeah, that's what I was worried about. Okay. Constructor is what? Eight? That's a smelter. Constructor. Right. Okay. Let's go ahead and put it here. And put a conveyor belt from here to there, and there, to there, beautiful, and we're just going to set this, this is going to be rods, and I need, you know, so many rods that it's criminal, and this is going to be iron ingots, alright, so to build more uh, miners and such, I would need another portable miner, and I'll make some of those, in the meantime, what I can do here is start building this back home. So I'll build a power pole and connect it to this and this and that. And then we're going to um, just one, one dedicated power pole back home for just this operation. And we'll build more of these when the time comes. 
And once the wire is too long, we just build one here. Alright, and then... Indeed, there's our base. Now, just for... Uh, hilarity's sake... How far across this chasm... Could my... Jump pad get me? Like, can I cross this? From here? You know what? Almost. Not really, but like, it, it is close. I don't know if you can change the steepness of it once you build it. Uh, you know, if you can angle it any. It doesn't look like from here, using the mouse, I can like, alter anything about it. So I'm just going to destroy that. But that was cool. That was a cool idea. It's very, very close. All right, anyway. Let's just get this going back. We'll do this the uh, the old-fashioned way for now. Yep, this is totally safe. I've hurt myself. I've broken my legs. Okay. And this is not beautiful. It's ugly, but it's going to get that job done eventually, years from now. There will be a job that is done. This entire planet will be covered in my power lines. Okay. Oh, God. Mm-hmm. All right. And so we'll just build another, you know station over here and we can probably fit something here so I'll just kind of build this pole uh, up to this point and then give me a biomass burner is at number six it is and we'll just kind of put it here and then we will connect it from here to here and then how much biomass do I have on me? Any? No. Okay, I'm going to get some biomass. What did we run out of? How are we doing here, by the way? Great. I got all the biomass out. Okay, so I can make a, a landing pad for myself if I want. Now, I'm going to go in here and get biomass. Oh, God. We've got a little bit of a backlog. Oh, because I'm not making any more. Right. Yeah, I'm going to have a problem getting biomass because I'm no longer collecting it. I kind of... I, I took a break. All right, so let's go ahead and uh, turn this back on. And... Uh, so we ran out of power at a lot of places. Okay. Uh, right. I'll do that in a second. Let me just see how much power this takes. It's only consuming 5.2 at the moment. Well, that's right, because the other facilities aren't turned on until they get ore. Um, okay, so now... I'll just put on regular biomass to get this going. For, for the time being. I'm going to go take my chainsaw out. Uh, oh, it has no power. Oh, my God. Where does it go? Where does all that biomass go? I know I had some. You know what I mean? Huh. Maybe this thing just ejects it when you de-equip it. All right, anyway. That's unfortunate. I wonder how much I need. Hopefully, it's just putting it right in the chainsaw. It's not. Oh, no, it is. Okay, great. Or maybe it just uses it straight out of your inventory, and you and it doesn't load in there, and you need to just carry it around. That, that would also make sense. Okay. Anyway, either way, it is time for me to go around chainsawing things to get my uh, biomass situation back under control before I go explore again. 
Luckily, the chainsaw makes that very easy. Awesome. Should probably eat. Get my health back. Huh. Alright. We can't target these. Okay. Yeah, sometimes it groups like a couple of trees together. It's interesting, but I'll take it. Okay, fantastic. Now, while I, before I go out and do more, let's get some started. So this is where I put leaves. So we'll just let those flow. Wood will go in the other one once I'm done gathering. There's bigger trees and things over here I can take out, but let's just take out these small uh, shrubs and such. Is this it's coal okay I know I will need coal for something else later you guys were telling me about that but I don't need it right now and it's not a uh, a mineable node it's just a now, these bigger trees give oh god these are the gold mine yeah this is what I should be going for shouldn't even waste my time on shrubs when I have large trees like that to get All right, terrific. Baddies around here? Oh god, yes. Oh no, I jumped sideways. That was an amazing jump, by the way. I just wanted you to know that. Eat, 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 eat. Eat. All right, awesome. Okay, now, my job is to go here. Yep, that looks good. And I'm going to go in here and just drop in all these leaves. Every bit of this can start getting turned into stuff. And then from here, what I'm going to do is uh, drop in all of the wood that I have acquired. Terrific. And then what we do is we just say, you are going to be making... Uh, biomass wood. Mm hmm. Great. Okay. And let's see. So everything here is reasonable. I'm going to go into this container and I'm going to take out uh, anything. that I might be able to use at the ma'am really quickly and just see if I've got any breakthroughs that have been sitting around uh, alien organs okay yes I did that start research alright cool I can do that Oh, I can actually do this, too. What is this? Rebar gun. This is what I'm talking about. This is a better gun to actually fight. Um, oops. Okay. Sorry, ma'am. I messed up. Medical inhaler. Great. A better healer. Uh, a way to fight them. An expanded tool belt. Yes. Look how good that is. Rebar gun. Spiked rebars to shoot. Inflated pocket dimension. Yes. Yes. All of this stuff. This is great. 
Um, I don't have enough ingots. I could smelt that down, but I don't know if it's going to make enough. And then, um, I need more crystal. Okay, cool. You know what? I stepped away for a second, and I was just thinking to myself, and then I realized there's a very simple answer to what I want to do. And it's called build a bridge. I can just build myself a bridge to get where I want to get. I can even just build little extensions to make the jump work, or I could just build myself an enormous bridge. And why not? So let's see how that goes. Let's see if the game lets you do that. It might not let you just build platforms without support underneath. But I'm going to try it. There might be a limit, you know, to how far you can go. But for example, look at this. Let me just build myself a bridge that... Let's go a little higher up. Make this easier on myself. Fantastic. And I'm just going to say, hey... Uh, yep. Just like that. And then, no. Yes. Yep, I was curious about this, and it looks like I don't need a support. I could be wrong, but it's kind of like Minecraft, you know? Who cares? Okay, and we're getting over there. So this might be the new way to travel. Right? Alright, we'll get closer. And now I can just queue up a... Uh, you know, ramp. And does this get me there? Almost. Let me just do it again. Oh god. Well, that's a little risky, isn't it? Uh, maybe... Mm, let me try this. No. Make it really, like, you know, <laughs> elaborate so I can't fall. Hmm. Okay. So, it's not my favorite. I would like it if I could maybe... Make an easier... Yeah, yeah, yeah. There you go. Access point down, like this. Let's see how this looks. There you go. And then I can snap it like that. Yeah, perfect. And this is, you know, very, very wasteful of materials, but I'm not in the business of caring too much right now. I just don't want to accidentally fall to my doom. And then there we go. We have a bridge. Now, I kind of want to look underneath this, if I can, and just see, is there, like, a support? Does the game build, like, a... Nope. Nope. That is just a bridge with no support. Hopefully it doesn't fall. Collapse and kill me. All right. So now what we need to do is... Oh, what's this? Let's go examine this. I'm sure it's totally safe. Blue power slug. Collecting blue power slug. Uh, sure. Sure. Yeah, we, we this have semi slug seems to oh emit unfamiliar energy readings which could potentially be retrofitted into fix it technology. A new research tree can now be accessed in the MAM. Awesome. Well, we found something new for the MAM. Alright. So let's start building conveyor. And run this baby as far as we can. Until it says no more. Once it says no mas, bam. Now, do I want to just run it, you know, along my bridge? Maybe that would be wise. Well. Uh huh. Awesome. Yeah, we can share the same bridge together. Mm -hmm. All 
Oh, I've got portable miners over here I can take out. Great. I didn't even see those things. Uh, actually, let me just pick these up now. You could use these to build the miners on the other side. Alright, now I don't know when the rods are coming, but they'll be coming around the mountain. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. And let's see. Where are we dumping all this concrete? Into this bin? Okay, great. And let me just kind of keep keep our platform going. Now, why am I doing this? I really don't know, but... It makes it look a little tidier to keep the floor uniform. Mm -hmm. Let me get out of the way. There we go. Alright, so then what I can do is just build a storage container like right here. And uh, this the belt might not connect to it. Alright, let me just kind of get rid of this belt then. I wonder if you could just delete like a small part of the belt and not just like the whole segment, but maybe not. All right. Let's see. So let me find out why I don't see any rods. Oh, there they are. Look at that glorious roll of the rods. Now we're getting there. Fantastic. All right, and let's see. Okay. From miles away come the rods. Okay, and I'm going to build these, and they'll, this will be another rod, ex, you know, uh, station. And if we get to a point where we don't want rods anymore, we can always just switch these constructors to build something else. But for the meantime, miner, there. And constructor. Uh, how's that? Oh, no, can't build that yet. Need a smelter. Need a smelter. I don't know if those actually lined up the way I was hoping. Invalid shape. Get out of here, invalid shape. I'm trying to point at you um, and have you. There you go. Just be right online. And then we're going to get ourselves a constructor. Again, we'll probably have to build it up pretty high because we don't want it to uh, have issues. Let's see if this will work. Oh yeah, it will. Alright, beautiful. So we need you to do iron. Yeah, we need you to do rods. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Honestly, I could probably merge these if I can, uh, you know, get this. Let's see if I can put a merger on here. Because the, the rate that they're coming out is pretty dispersed. So let's see if I can throw in a, a merger kind of like... Right there. And let's see. Does it work? Is this working? Yes. And then what I need is for this to kind of somehow connect there. And then it's going to go through this rock, but it will work. All right. So now we need to build a power pole. And we need to start throwing in some lines. So we got to connect the this to that. This to that. And then also... 
Let's see, that's connected, that's connected. Uh, yep. And then let's just kind of throw this over here. We'll just mimic these. Place them similarly. Oh, there's another one of those blue slugs. I should get that. Uh, well, now there's bad guys over here. I didn't count on the baddies, but here they are. You bad guys, I'm trying to get this slug. Great. Okay. Now let's... Oh, God. Almost fell to my doom. Let's see how this baby goes. Power line. Roll it. Mm-hmm. You just tell me when the power line is too long, and we will make adjustments. Uh huh. And then we're going to go this way. Mm hmm. No, oh my. Almost fell to my doom. It was close. Okay, and we'll disconnect this. Uh, we'll just put it over here with the rest of these, like in this section. And then we'll build ourselves another biomass burner, kind of uh, right there and then we will just connect this biomass burner to this and then let's just check on the biomass situation you're out of power you're out of power we're all out of power all right okay we have some not a ton but a little bit oh my bag huh my my poor bag all right, uh, sort. And, okay, I made some space. So first things first, let me get power uh, where I can. Now, uh, I'm going to split this, and let's just drop in 100 right here. And then this new one here needs 100 there. Alright, and hopefully, how much concrete do I have here? Oh, yeah. Now we're getting concrete. Great. Okay, so hopefully everything is on at the moment. Looks like it. Yes, okay. And we're going to check out power slugs. So let's uh, start the research. And um, we could make a yellow power shard slug scanning. Um, I guess this would allow us to scan four slugs. And this is overclock production. Oh, no. Um, I don't have the whatever that yellow slug is, but I can do this to scan for more slugs. So let's start that research. What do we got here? Nothing yet. Oh, nothing ever, because this is... What are we making here? We were making uh, reinforced iron plates, but we need screws. Well, here you go. Make some screws, and then you need what? Just regular plates? You've got plates. Okay, perfect. All right, you make me the plates. You're making biofuel. Okay, so I have a lot of stuff that maybe I want to either research it to ma'am or just put away. So let's see about this. Uh, I really don't need to carry these flower petals at all. I don't think I need all of this, like, iron ore. I'm just going to kind of put this... Um, yeah, why don't you just take all my ore? Can you not hold it? What is this? Iron ore. This is copper. Oh, that's why you can't hold it. Okay, here, just take all this then. Um... 
copper ore. Huh, okay, well. Oh, because this is where I make my copper, not where I... I gotcha. Alright. Oh, is this thing backed up? Oh god, you better believe it is. You know what that is? The reason for that. It's idle. It just takes forever to even... I'll take some of these out, then maybe this will help it speed itself up. Yep. It's got, you know, too many for what it's doing. Okay, well, I'll just keep this in this little tank over here. Extra ore in case it's ever necessary. God, I have so much of it. Uh-huh. Okay. Um, I'm going to put these motors away. I don't have any technology that requires them at the moment. Okay, this is slightly better. Now, let's go check out uh, the ma'am. Are, are you doing your thing? Yeah, you are. It's just there's a backup. Okay. Oh, we got power out over here? Sure do. There you go. Alright, let's get that back going. I need some more biofuel for that, but in the moment, let me just check my ma'am. God, I got lost. I got lost in my own garage here. Alright. Sweet. Uh, yeah, I guess I might as well. Now, for this, we would need uh, a bunch of screws, reinforced, and rotors. Okay, let's go do that. I feel like it'll help us to just give us a better gun than this thing so we can explore more. And this needs rods. This is why we were getting into rods in the first place, so we could build more rotors. All right, here's a bunch of rods. Cool. I give it some time, and we start to... Oh, God, we've got screws. We really have caught up while I've been putzing around. That's fantastic news. All right, here, take these rods and take all these screws and go to town. Did you make any, by the way, rotors? You made some. Okay. And then, let me look over here. No. Alright, let's check out what this is doing. This is my... Uh... Oh, this... This thing is making what? It's making reinforced iron plates. So what it would need is plates in one side and screws on the other. So I can give you, like, a ton of screws, and then this will start feeding them in. And how are you doing plate-wise? Oh, God, you've got plenty. Okay, you're good. And then this would be where we're making these. Okay. It's actually not bad. It's not miserable. All right, ma'am. What do you need for uh, alien organisms? For this, we would need uh, more screws. Okay, I have those. I have a separate container just for screws. <laughs> yes, my my offshore screw operation finally came through. Okay, okay, it's all coming together now. I've caught up a little bit. Um, oh, am I researching? I'm researching power slugs, though, right now. Okay, great. Well, in the meantime, what other deficiencies do we have. We have a bunch of rods coming in, so that should be doing well for us. We've got a bunch of... The wire isn't really too big of a problem. Um... Oh, right. I can't even do this until I start upgrading my space elevator, which is going to be quite the process. Okay, you know what? Um, I think it's time because I need so many of these. I can start feeding into this. So I'm going to make 
uh, a container for rods and a container for screws so that we can just have this on autopilot. So I'll just go here. Uh-huh. And then right next to it. Except, oh god, these are going the wrong way. I've embarrassed myself. All right, I want it to go the other way, please. Uh-huh. One. Two. All right, let's see if we can connect these babies. Uh-huh. One. Two. Awesome. Right, you're going to be screws. And you can be rods, just so I know. All right, and then I'm going to go over here, and I'm going to be like, hey, give me all these rods, and give me all these screws. Awesome. Oh, I'm running a little on wire. Who would have thought? There we go. All right, and then you can have uh, more screws by a bunch. There you go. And then... I don't have many rods, so let me go check my uh, how my rod production is moving. Oh, we got power problem over here. Let me get some more biofuel. I mean, it, it's like Minecraft. I, I want to start putting up signs, uh, and maybe I can do that with color coding, with some of the uh, you know the technology for like color coding and and the like. repainting things. Alright, so... Which one was out of power? This one over here. Cool, the MAM research is done. So now I can start researching the rebar gun. Fantastic. Um, I want this, please. Can't afford. What am I missing? Screws. Screws, no problem. I've got those. But, um... Wait a minute, what are these? Oh, no, this is for my assembler. It's like, what is happening? Okay, right, right, right. Uh, this is where my bars are going. Oh, yeah, now they're coming in. Now they're coming in. Okay, great. Well, if we need screws, I have some here. Let me just, um take these back and start this up on the ma'am. No, no, not this. Wrong thing. Alright. Ma'am, I need you to do the rebar gun. Start it. Fantastic. And then I need to take these rods away. Mm-hmm. What's going on? Are you making these anymore? What happened? Idle? Did the power cut out? Yeah, the power's got a, we've got a problem with the power. Okay. Interesting. Alright, here, take all these rods. That should keep you busy. Then let me, show me what happened with the power. Which Where's the power? Which one? Which one? This one? Did you just run out, or did we blow the fuse here? We ran out. Okay, perfect. Just take all of the biomass, honestly. Alright. Beautiful. Beautiful. I'm lost in my own museum, but I am able to realize that my resources are finally coming in, right? So this is good. So I just need to leave this running. I will probably need to get more biomass. I think we are, we're out of wood. Yeah, I need to go chainsawing, uh, but that's going to require biofuel here, and I have some. Okay, good. All right, well, let's go on a little chainsaw trip. Man, let's go for those big trees over there. Those look good. I want to get the bigger tool belt. I don't know what I can put on my body, but that sounds awesome. All 
All right, I'm going to roll over here. Oh, my God. What is this? Sulfur. Huh. Do I have any beacons on me? Yeah. I'm going to actually uh, label this really fast. Well, I don't need a beacon. Never mind. The, the reason I uh, don't need it is uh, because I'm just going to mine this right here. It, I can't put a node here or anything, so I might as well just get it myself. Data shows this is a mix of sulfide and sulfate minerals. It could be an indication of recent volcanic activity. A new research tree exploring volatile self-defense applications can now be accessed in the land. <laughs> volatile self-defense applications. That's hilarious. Oh my god. Look at that death purple thing in the middle there. What is that? I might need my rebar gun for this area. Yep, definitely need to rebar gun. Oh no, they're hitting me. Look, I'm just trying to deforest. Is there a real problem with that? Oh my. Alright, uh... No, you guys don't even need to do this. It's not necessary. Thank you for pushing me ahead, actually. Appreciate that. I'll take these. Oh, come on. You still following me? That was... What am, what am I getting hit by now? The gas? Alright. Uh, my god, man. The gas. Alright. Oop, I don't need to eat that much. Um, but that was fun. Okay. Let's go ahead now and uh, let's see if we can chainsaw this. Okay, no. If I get too close to that, I need to get a gas mask or something. All right, that's fine. Fine. I'll get a gas mask. All right. Jeez. Well, I think we're at a really good place. And I'll stop here, everyone. We'll pick up next time. Thanks for watching. Take care.